shocker as military attempt to take over the government house. See what stopped them and how they got stopped. You see, very, very close. Very close. In the process of stopping the protesters, the military want to hijack the government. You see that you see the idea these people want to use. Then they will now say, okay, since the protest has persisted, Mr. President, you have no choice than to what to be unseated. But luckily, Tulum is not even in Nigeria because you need to be around for military to take over comfortably. Let's check the contents, my dear listeners. This is today's news. In a dramatic escalation of nationwide protest on Thursday, the Inspector General of Police, IGP Kayode Egbetokun, reported a series of alarming incidents, according to Egbetokun. Some protesters in at least eight states attempted to seize government buildings, destroying police stations and giving the military the chances to take over. Speaking at a press briefing late Thursday night, Egberto Kuhn provided details on the chaos that unfolded across the nation. He revealed that during the protest, one police officer was murdered, several others were injured, and multiple police stations were destroyed. This widespread unrest has prompted the police force to increase their readiness, with all units now operating at a heated state of alert. The IGB characterized the protest as a mess, uprising and emphasizing the need for a robust response to restore order. He stated, police stations have been destroyed. There have been attempts to take over the government houses. The violence was reported in key areas, such as the Federal Capital Territory, FCT, Kaduna, Kano, and Gombe, where there were unprovoked attacks on security personnel, leading to the death of one officer and severe injuries to others. Now, strategy army could use take over Nigeria. Say, I said this. You will see. You will see. You will say that I said this. Strategy. You know, they have said it that they will take over. They, they have said it with their mouth that they will take over. But when the matter gets worse, and believe me, one, probably one of the protests that will take place that will now lead to the death of people is what will now force the military to take over. They will now use that as, a, as an opportunity that this is what made them to take over. And that will now happen with or without the presence of two. My people, in fact, now we could just pray to God, make, make uh, this nation better because <laughs> if we just still rely on this military takeover, uh, me and you, we go red or he go red, giddy gunny. So now waiting, we know if we pray for or call for. Because if we allow it, even yourself, you will be shaked. You will shake. Well, let me hear from you on this matter and then let's know what your opinions and what your take actually is. It's a pleasure. Don't forget to click on the red subscribe buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.